White streets of London. We're going to come out this road, or just streets, I say, and turn left here. And here's the BT Tower, British Telecom. They don't use it anymore, I don't think they use it. Because there used to be, I don't know if we see it, they're here, there used to be um, uh, satellite dishes for uh, British Telecom, but no longer in use. We're all in this modern age now, so yeah. At least you've seen the BT Tower. Gonna get a couple of shots right here. And it's also one of the oldest, it's in the modern buildings you can see. And then you have an old pub in the middle of nowhere. Gonna get a couple of photos here. Just a few snip snaps there. I should do like a slideshow really. Yeah, thinking about it. Just put in the comments what you think, if I should do a slideshow of, of photos that I've taken. I don't do it as Instagram as much as I normally do. I should really. But yeah, it's nice to see the BT Tower right here. Right here, right here. You can't get to it though. But this is the quiet streets of London. There we are, it's getting closer and closer. You don't realise the sheer size until you get up to it. We're going to work our way. No, not road wind, actually. We're on Cleveland Street, that's it. Huh. We're going to uh, look at the size of that, though. Epic view. I wasn't concentrating, I nearly got hit by a bike in London. Motorbike. That would have been bad. Four. You know what is it? Do a quite electric one. So it didn't help. Huh. Quiet as can be. I don't like them. God, my heart rate's going a bit. I'm going to be very vigilant now. I, ne I never recalled when I crossed the road though. Anyway, see so the BT Tower, that's all it is. Huh. Certainly it's not my time to die yet, it looks a bit, because <laughs> if a bike stopped in front of it, oh my, I'm still heart rate beating. All right. Oh, here's the old street, old, old London lights. Here are the old London street lights. Oh, I like the restaurants down here out the way. I like the really out of the way. How's an Indian that is? Wow. How's the tailors there? An actual tailors. No way. You get your customised suits there. Got Donna kebab. Oh, cool. I like it because out of the way. Dentist down there. Another little calf. Which is closed. Oh, no, it's open. I like it because it's out of the way. It's quiet. It's cool. You've got a real American food there. Hmm, interesting. That sounds epic. American style. That'll be worth checking out next time. Ah, oh, fish bones. Fine owl pub. Oh wow. There's an interesting shops down there. Like the modern buildings to my left and the old buildings to my right. Oh. Oh. Interesting. Oh. When the borrower comes in now, we're going to walk our way to the train station and we get a train back. We can get a train back anytime anyway. There's no time restriction because weekend, off peak all day, all day. All the shops, and then you've got the old buildings of London. Oh, that Fritz, Fritz Roy, Fritz Roy Muse. So it could be a news, street, street names are named after what's in London. So it could be a newspaper just down there. Just down there. Muse for newspapers. Oh, Four Lanterns restaurant here. Interesting. They've got an Oriental Chinese restaurant down here.
got all the posh buildings here. All the people are staying. I hate to think how much they pay for rent. I bet it's not cheap. They're old buildings, they've got the old fashioned windows. Literally. Old fashioned windows, man. I've got the modern windows at my house, I'm saying. <laughs> They've got the old windows. Samuel Mawson, 1791 to 1872, American painter invented the Morse code. Lived here, this building here, from 1812 to 1815. Yeah, this building right here. How cool is that? You've got to find a lot of blue plaques over London. There's a lot of history. You just got to find it. It's got to be potluck to find them all. It's just a matter of finding it. We're going to end our journey up the top here anyway. The George and the Dragon pub. I love that. Very British. <laughs> and what's interesting? Dragon this year, Chinese New Year. How cool is that? Well, another restaurant here. It's interesting that they're out the way. We, we can get these in the UK now. Palm trees. We can grow them now. Apparently. And they're here. In people's gardens. Yeah. I found we've got the climate for it now, apparently. And now winter day shows up. Apparently a hot, a hot stream of us lets them have heaven now. Okay, we're going to find a train station and get a train home. Oh, it's been a good day. I've got a lot of shopping anyway, heavy books, but I'm going to do a review on the books. I want to do a review on the books because it's what I found and it's what's happened today. It's something special because I had a sign-in to go to and that was just lucky. Oh, look at this, random. Okay guys, I'll leave you here on the main streets of London. We live here at Great Portland Street and I'll see you another time on another adventure. Let's turn the camera. I will see you next time on one another adventures. Until next time. Stations. Look at that, one of the older stations. When you're on metro boats in there. Cool. Tower Hill, King's Cross. Little street yet.